All right, welcome to stretching on your stomach. Now, most of us will do this in a bed, but if you can't go on the floor, go ahead. We're going to start on your stomach. So the first piece is where do you put your head, okay? Some people put their head straight down on the mat. That is fine. I can't really do that because of the microphone. Other people will turn their head and lay it flat, also fine. I'm actually going to lift my head so it's gently off the floor just a little bit, okay? So the first stretch is called ankle grabs. I'm going to bend one knee, right, bring my heel towards my butt. Now I want to grab that ankle. Some of us will stretch straight back. Other of us will have to side bend like this. Side bend, grab the ankle and pull and hold, okay? Pull and hold, and release. All right, so let's do that one together. So start with our left leg, so bend your left knee, bend your left knee, reach back, grab your ankle, pull and hold. Pull and hold, and, and release. Let's do the other side, so you're gonna bend your right knee, Reach back, grab the ankle, and hold. And relax, okay? So this next stretch is called Baby Cobra, so watch me. So Baby Cobra, you're going to put your hands right underneath your shoulders, okay? Now, from here, you're going to bring your hands slightly forward. They're almost like in line with your eyes. And then you're going to bring your elbows down. Once your elbows are down, you're going to lift your chest, lift your chest, Lift your chest and then push gently with your arms so you're resting on your forearms. Last piece is tuck your hips underneath so you don't feel it in your lower back. So let's do it together here. We're on our stomachs, hands underneath our shoulders, hands come slightly forward, elbows come down, lift the back, lift the back, push with the arms and hold, tuck the hips underneath. And release. All right, so this next stretch, this is called Cobra. So Cobra, same setup as Baby Cobra. My hands are underneath my shoulders. I want to bring my hands slightly forward. I'm going to lift my back, lift my back. Now watch me. Instead of using my elbows, I'm going to use my hands, and that allows me to elevate a little bit higher. Now, if you feel it in your lower back, go down a little bit and tuck your hips more. Okay, so we're here. Hold. All right, let's do it together. Ready? Hands underneath the shoulders. Slide the hands forward. Lift the back. Lift the back. Straighten the arms out and hold. Okay. And release. Nice. All right, so we're going to go into the next stretches, but we're going to be working in a different position. So watch me. We're going to do a cobra. We're going to lift our hips up. And we're going to come into what's called crawl or quadruped, okay? So from crawl here, if you need to roll up the mat or grab a towel for your knees, go ahead and do that now. I'm going to demonstrate without it because some of us will be in the bed. So this stretch from here, this is called thread the needle. So watch me. I'm going to take my left arm. I'm going to reach underneath my right shoulder and down towards my right knee, and I'm going to drop, boom, my shoulder to the mat, and I'm going to hold. Okay, good. That's the, the needle. Okay, so let's go ahead and try it together. Try the other side. So take your right arm here. You're going to slide, slide, slide underneath. Drop the shoulder. And if you can, you can get your ear down. You're going to hold. It's a twisting exercise. Okay, let's come back up. Let's see the other side. So here, thread the needle. You're going to thread the needle through and hold. Good. Really nice. All right, and we're coming back up, okay? So this next stretch, this is called pigeon, okay? So this one's a little bit more advanced. I want you to go slow. So watch me. I'm going to take my right leg and bring it forward. Take your, bring your leg and bring it forward. Now, ideally, my right foot is past my other knee, okay? Now, I'm going to grab that foot, and I'm going to pull it across. Boom. I'm going to pull it across. So it looks like this. Watch me. So I'm here. I'm here. I'm going to pull it across like a so. All right. So you're in that position. That's the starting position. And if you want more of a stretch, take your back knee and slide it back. 
For the more advanced, you can drop to your forearms even all the way down. Okay? So let's go ahead and do that one together. Start with our left leg. So we're going to crawl. Bring your left leg forward. Okay? Take that ankle. Pull it across your body. Here. Now what we're going to do is we're going to take our back leg. Inch back. Inch back. And then drop down for pigeon and hold. Good. Okay, coming up, let's go ahead and do the other side. So reset into crawl. Bring the right leg, come forward, come forward. Take this ankle, slide it across here. And then we're going to slide the leg back, slide the leg back. And we're going to drop down, drop down, and drop down for pigeon. Hold. Okay, and coming back up here, recenter the crawl. Now, there is child's pose. We're going to skip that one because that's in a different stretch workout. From here, we're going to do what's called frog. So my knees are going to go apart. So if you watch from here, you can see right here, folks, see how my knees are coming apart? That's what I want, okay? And from here, I'm going to drop my chest down. And the last piece is your feet, as your knees come apart, bring your feet with you. Bring your feet with you. And your toes can be up, your toes can be down. I have to kind of go in between. And then from there, I drop my hips down for a frog. Okay, so let's go ahead and do it together. So we're here. We're going to crawl. Separate the knees. Separate the feet. Drop your hips down and back. Stretching out the inner thighs. Okay, hold. Okay, and we're coming back up here. Brilliant. All right. So I have two more. Those are the advanced ones. So if you want to just skip to the part where we do all of them together, go ahead now. But let me show you these advanced ones. So the first advanced one, this is called bow. So it's actually a double ankle grab, okay? So stretch is called bow here. I'm going to bend this, bend my right knee, bend my left knee. I'm going to reach back, grab one ankle, reach back, grab the other ankle, okay? Now, the advantage of bow is I can actually kick my legs and lift my chest a little bit, okay? This is a more yoga-esque move, but I'm getting my shoulders involved. I'm getting my chest involved. And release. Okay, so let's try the one together. Bend both ankles. Reach back, grab. Reach back, grab. Kick and lift the chest. Hold. 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 And release. Nice job. All right, the last one is called scorpion, okay? So be careful here. So scorpion, your hands are out like a T, and you're going to lift. Watch me. So I'm going to watch scorpion. So I'm going to lift my right leg up, lift my right leg up, and twist and come across the body so my right ankle is reaching towards my left hand, okay? So just watch. I'm going to change the angle here. So I'm here like this. See this leg comes up, and it twists across the body. For scorpion. Okay, so let's go ahead and try that one here. So we're down, hands out like a T, lift the right leg, twist across, and hold, 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 and back. Good, left leg up, twist the other way, and twist. I'll lift the wall, twist, hold, and relax. Nice job. All right, you ready? Let's go all the way through, stretching our stomach. That tutorial. So we're going to flatten our stomach. Your next however you want, you can turn it, lay it flat. So bend one knee, reach back, grab your ankle, hold. And release. Switch legs, reach back with the right, grab. And release. Okay, we're coming to baby cobra. Hands underneath the head. Hands come forward. Elbows come down. Lift the chest. Resting on the elbows. Okay, now from here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my hands and lift my elbows up. This is cobra. This kind of flows in. Okay, now from cobra, I'm going to lift my hips up. Cobra push up. Walk the hands back. Okay, we're going to come in to thread the needle. Take your right arm, 
thread through, drop your shoulder down, hold. Okay, coming in, left arm, thread through, drop the shoulder down, and hold. Okay, coming back up, we're going to come into frog. Okay, so knees apart, feet apart, push the hips back, push hips back, drop down, hold. Okay, we're coming into pigeon. So you're back in crawl. Bring the right leg forward. Take your right foot. Bring it past your left knee. Past your left knee. Slide the back knee down. Drop in. Hold. Okay. Good. Coming back up. Here. We're going to switch legs. Bring the left leg forward. Move that hip. Move that foot, bring the back knee back, bring the back knee back, and dropping down, and hold. Very nice. Good, okay, from here, we're gonna go back onto our stomach for our last two, the advanced ones. So you're gonna bend both legs, Grab both ankles for bow and hold. Okay, last one, scorpion. So go ahead, lift your left leg up and twist across your body. And back center, and then that right leg up, twist all the way across your body, and hold. Recenter, and release. All right, there you go, folks. That's stretching on your stomach. Let's keep your stretching program going. There's a lot of other stretching workouts in different positions. Okay, so I'll see you in the next video.